We are talking about uh, some changes here in Southern California for this week. Cooler temperatures we can see outside. Uh, look at that downtown Los Angeles with that cloud cover in the backdrop and we're going to continue to see that pattern over the next several days still. So we're talking about some cool temperatures and yes, that satellite radar showing us the cloud cover overhead. So that's going to make for some uh, cool numbers this afternoon. Most of us not getting out of the 60s. That includes beaches, LA inland Orange County, the valleys, high desert at 62, upper 50s in the inland empire, mostly cloudy skies and mid 40s in the mountains with increasing winds. As we take a look at what is headed our way, we're experiencing those winter type temperatures, but officially winter does not begin until 23 days. We are 27 days now until Christmas. Yes, the countdown is on and 34 days until we ring in 2023. All right, today it's about the cool temperatures, the clouds, and also the winds for some of us. If you are in the higher elevation, some of those mountains and deserts really experiencing some strong winds. So wind advisories in place for places like the Antelope Valley, mountains of Riverside, San Bernardino County, into the Coachella Valley through late tonight and into early Tuesday. Here's our future cast with the wind. So you'll see that we'll continue to experience the strong winds. Again, a lot of us not being impacted, but if you you are in the mountains and deserts, you are certainly feeling it. Or if you're going to be traveling through those areas, even in the overnight hours, we're looking at gusts in the 40s out through the Antelope Valley. By tomorrow morning, really for all of us, we're expecting some calmer conditions. So it will be a different story. We'll get a little bit of relief from those westerly winds. And then by Tuesday evening, really not seeing much of an issue most of us in the single digits. Here's a look at rain chances. So by late tonight, we could pick up a little bit of rain, but really the big chance of getting some wet weather that happens at the end of the week by Friday. Take a look at what is headed our way. We have this big area of low pressure that's going to be moving in and there is a lot of moisture associated with this. So we could be talking about some rain as early as Friday. So by Thursday, already Northern California is being impacted by the wet weather. For us, late Thursday into Friday, here we are 7.45 a.m. commute time, and we are seeing that rain right over Southern California. So we'll continue fine tuning the arrival of the rain and exactly how much we could expect. But just know that wet weather is on the horizon as we head into late in the week. And even by Sunday, we could be talking about some more rain. So by the end of the week, cool temperatures, some clouds, and yes, that rain and even some snow up in the mountains. So we'll talk about the seven day forecast, what temperatures are gonna look like over the next seven days in just a few minutes. Jasmine. Researchers are reporting promising early results of an experimental vaccine to protect against